My name is Dan Page, and I'm a Digico Sales Application Specialist. We're here today with the SD Consoles to have a look at the wide range of dynamic processors that we offer. The Stealth Digital Processing Engine, found in all SD Consoles, provides engineers with a unique set of Dynamics processing options. From the industry-leading SD7 down to the small and powerful SD11, you'll find the same Dynamics processing tools on every single one of our consoles. Traditionally, engineers requiring dynamic processing, that's dynamic EQ, multiband compressors, DSs, had no choice but to have racks of outboard effects. These days, there are plenty of DSP-based plugins that add this type of processing to other consoles, but they're add-ons. They cost you money. And the number of instances, the number of times you can use each of them, can be pretty limited. So what does Digico have that the others don't? Every single SD console includes native channel processing that includes these essential dynamics processing tools. No expensive plugins to buy, no outboard racks to connect, just the tools you need exactly where you need them. On the flagship SD7, we've squeezed all of our unique dynamics processors into every single channel, all 256 of them, inputs, outputs, auxes, groups, and matrices. This amazing power and flexibility means you never have to worry about not having the right processing where you need it. If we look at the other consoles, we provide the same toolbox of processing, dynamic EQ, multiband dynamics, compressors, DSs, and it's all still native channel processing. And for each of these consoles, from the new SD5 here down to the compact SD11, you have a free choice over where you use each of these dynamic options. Let's use the SD9 as an example. You can enable Dynamic EQ simultaneously on any eight channels. That could be input channels or output buses, mono or stereo. Makes no difference, just any eight channels. And the same goes for multiband compressors. Any eight channels can have these enabled. This clever dynamic assignment of available processing allows you to choose when and where you use them. It's worth remembering that all of these SD consoles have a comprehensive set of standard dynamics processors on every channel, including two single band compressors, a gate, a ducker, and a deesser. So let's have a quick look at the processing options in more detail and how they may be used to make your life easier and your mixes sound better. Starting with dynamic EQ, we have the ability to turn individual bands of EQ into a dynamic EQ module. But what does this actually do, and how does it help you? With standard parametric equalizers, you dial in your EQ, and it affects your audio in a fixed way, irrespective of changes to the input source. But if we're dealing with dynamic sources, vocals, or an acoustic instrument, then the nature of those instruments can change dramatically with volume, and a fixed EQ is no longer sufficient. A singer might have a nice voice when singing normally, but when they sing loudly, the characteristic of the voice might change and different EQ is then needed. Dynamic EQ is the perfect tool to deal with problems like this. It allows us to gradually apply EQ based on the incoming signal passing a predetermined threshold, the level at which the EQ starts to take effect. And from that point, the further past the threshold the input signal goes, the more EQ is applied. It's usual for this type of EQ to be applied as a cut, removing unwanted frequencies when the threshold is reached. But the flexible nature of Digico's dynamic processing allows the user complete control over how and when the EQ is applied. All SD consoles also include multiband compressors. Again, let's take a look at what this actually means and the advantage that it gives you over a single band compressor. A single broadband compressor reacts to the loudest signal coming in and the entire mix is reduced in level as a result. So, as an example, a loud kick drum could result in the entire mix getting squashed. This intermodulation issue is often called pumping, and the problem is perfectly solved by the multiband compressor. The Digico multiband compressor is actually three single band compressors built into a single unit. The incoming signal is split by a pair of crossover filters into three bands a low band, a middle band, and a high band and then we compress each of these independently. Any excessively loud signal that comes in will only affect the band it is in. Our loud kick drum from earlier would result in a gain reduction in the lower band, 
but the middle band and the high band will remain unaffected. The problem of pumping has gone. We've looked at two examples of how Digico's dynamic processing can help you solve real-world mixing problems without the need for additional racks of equipment or expensive add-ons. Every SD console provides you with the dynamic options you need, with DSs, compressors, gates, and duckers on every channel, and the choice of dynamic EQ and multiband dynamics, Digico won't leave you wanting more.